The King of the Sky has a complex landing gear design. The sophistication of the landing gear structures of the Airbus A380 airplane is an epitome of technology and precision. Our curiosity then lies on how exactly does the landing gear of an Airbus A380 function? It is quite a marvel. The Airbus A380, the world's largest passenger airliner, relies heavily on its robust and intricate landing gear system. You see, landing gear is not just about wheels touching the ground, it's a complex mechanism that ensures the safety of hundreds of passengers on board. From absorbing the shock of landing to providing a smooth taxi, its importance is paramount. So let's examine the design and features of this engineering marvel. The Airbus. A 380's landing gear is not just a simple mechanism, it's a marvel of engineering design and innovation. The main landing gear consists of two sets of six wheels each, arranged in a tandem layout. This 12-wheel configuration not only distributes the plane's weight evenly, but also reduces the pressure exerted on the runway. The materials used are a testament to modern engineering. High-strength, heat-treated aluminum alloys form the main body, chosen for their lightweight yet durable nature. The tires are crafted from a special rubber compound, designed to withstand the high-speed impact of landing. Now what sets the A380's landing gear apart? It's the unique features like the electronic control system, which allows for precise movement and stowage. Then there's the brake to vacate system, a smart feature that calculates the optimal braking force for each landing. Now that we've seen the design and features, let's move on to how it actually works. The working principle of the Airbus. A 380's landing gear is a combination of mechanical and hydraulic systems. The hydraulic system is the heart of the landing gear's operations, powering and controlling the movement of the landing gear. When the A380 is ready for takeoff, the hydraulic system sends high-pressure fluid into the landing gear's actuators. This causes the landing gear to retract, folding neatly into the belly of the aircraft. Now, when the A380 is ready to touch back down on terra firma, the process reverses. The hydraulic system redirects the fluid, causing the actuator to extend the landing gear. The wheels then lock into position, ready for landing. But it doesn't stop there. The hydraulic system also controls the braking system, ensuring a safe and smooth landing. And that's how the landing gear moves. But what about when the plane lands? That's where the shock absorber system comes into play. The shock absorber system is a crucial component of the Airbus A380's landing gear. Just imagine the force exerted when an aircraft of such magnitude touches down. The shock absorber system is our unsung hero absorbing and dissipating this impact, ensuring a smooth landing for the plane and its occupants. The system is ingeniously designed, featuring a combination of hydraulic and mechanical elements. As the plane lands, the shock absorber, also known as the oleo strut, compresses. This compression forces hydraulic fluid into a smaller chamber, slowing down the rate of compression and thereby reducing the impact of landing. Simultaneously, mechanical springs assist in absorbing the remaining shock. In essence, this system works like a giant spring, albeit a highly sophisticated one. It's a beautiful dance of physics and engineering, where force, pressure and mechanical design come together to create a smooth landing experience. So the shock absorber system ensures a smooth landing for the Airbus A380, making it a crucial part of the landing gear. In summary, the Airbus A380's landing gear is a marvel of engineering. We've delved into its intricate design, explored its unique features and dissected its working principles. We've seen how the hydraulic system operates and how the shock absorber system cushions the impact of landing. It's an impressive testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of aeronautical excellence. So, next time you see an Airbus A380, remember the complex engineering that goes into just one part of it, the landing gear.